When grinding permanent tax, what must you be careful not to do? Make the root face thinner or the gap wider. How much strength should be left after feathering a permanent tack? Enough strength to hold the joint securely. What must be done to all stop and starts of a pipe root weld? Must be feathered. What is the maximum length of a pipe tack? 19 mm, 3 quarters. How are bridge tacks different from permanent tacks? Bridge tacks do not contact the land of a weld. Bridge tacks must be removed. What technique do you use to weld a 1G pipe with GMAW? Downhill progression between 1 o'clock to 2 o'clock position pipe is rotated. What is the minimum number of tacks that can be used when welding pipe? 3. What is the distance between the plates on a 1GF, 3GF, 4GF? 13 mm, 1 half inch, comma, what is the electrical stick out for all FCAW fillet welds? 12.7 mm, 19 mm, 1 half, 3 fourth. What inclination do you use for the root of a 1 FFCAW weld? 15 degree, 30 degree backhand. What inclination do you use for the fill cap pass for a 1 FFCW weld? 0 degree, 20 degree backhand. What is your electrode angle on a MCW fillet weld? 1 half the included joint angle. What mode of metal transfer are you using for a MCW 1F fillet weld? Spray metal transfer. Name three of the welding variables found on a WPS. Base metal, filler metals, positions, preheat, postheat, joint configuration, techniques. Any other detail pertaining to the weld, what is a WPS backed or supported by? Procedure Qualification Record, PQR. What does CWB use in conjunction with a WPS? A Welding Procedure Data Sheet, WPDS. What is the space between the flat and grooved plate on a CWB test? 16 mm, 5 8 inch. What are two things a WPDS details? Supporting WPS, referencing documents, base metal types thickness or diameter ranges, filler metal type, Diameter and amperage range, shielding gas type, gas flow rate, joint design, edge preparation, root gap, root face, tacking type, backing, weld techniques, extra notes and direction for low temperature service. What is the common practice when using two methods of welding? Put the root in with one process and fill the joint in with another. Process that is capable of increasing weld metal deposition ensure uniform root edge preparation and alignment with equal spacing along the entire length of the joint on fit up of a groove weld. Comma, what is the included angle on all double process GMAW slash FCAW welds? One half the included angle. All rod aluminum alloys experience increased strength when they are cold worked. 
Name two factors when choosing a filler metal for aluminum GMAW. Required tensile strength, ductility, operating temperature, corrosion resistance, ease of welding, color match, storing aluminum filler wires in a dry heated area prevents what? Prevents moisture pickup. Prevents harmful oxides from forming on the surface. What does anodizing do? Makes the oxide layer thicker. Electrochemical process. What is one of the properties anodizing changes? Hardness, wear resistance, electrical insulation, increased corrosion resistance. Name two ways aluminum is formed. Extruded, rolled, stamped, drawn, forged, cast. Name one way aluminum can be cast. Die cast, permanent mold, sand casting, centrifugal casting. Name one hydrogen source that could affect your GMAW weld on aluminum. Lubricants, hydrated surface oxides, filler rods, torch leaks, fill in the blanks. Due to its blank blank blank, aluminum requires a heat input four times more rapid than mild steel to raise its temperature to the melting point. High thermal conductivity. What is the melting point of pure aluminum? 660 degrees Celsius, 1220 degrees Fahrenheit. What is the range of melting points for aluminum alloys? 477 to 657 degrees Celsius. 890 to 1215 degrees Fahrenheit. What are physical properties of aluminum? A. Density. F. Melting point. B. Electrical conductivity. G. Non-magnetic. C. Thermal conductivity. H. Non-sparkling. I. Reflective. E. Coefficient of linear expansion. How much visible light can polished aluminum reflect? A. 80%. List two mechanical properties of aluminum. Tensile strength. Yield strength. Modulus of elasticity. Ductility. Why is aluminum well suited for cryogenic applications? Aluminum strength increases at sub-zero temperatures. How do you offset the distortion that can occur when welding aluminum? Use more tacks. What must be removed before any welding can occur on aluminum? The oxide layer. Aluminum is corrosion resistant, but what type of corrosion can take place? Galvanic corrosion. Through what process? Electrolysis process. What is aluminum obtained from? Bauxite ore. Why is aluminum generally added to steel? To deoxidize and control grain growth. Why should oxygen never be for cleaning conduit liners? Oil may be present, which presents an explosion hazard. Name one factor to consider when choosing a wire feed system. Type of wire you're welding, the location of welding, size and shape of the structure being welded. What is the desired mode of metal transfer when welding aluminum with GMAW? Spray metal transfer.
What does a constant voltage power source offer GMAW when welding aluminum? Stable arc characteristics. What is the most common aluminum alloy for casting? Aluminum silicon alloy. What are rod alloys made from? Cast ingots. Name two forms rod aluminum can be formed into. Foil, wires, sheet, tubes, plate, extruded shapes forgings, bars. What welding current is used for welding aluminum? DCP electrode positive reverse polarity. What can determine your arc length when welding aluminum? Alloy group. What happens to water when welding aluminum? Water breaks down. The hydrogen enters the aluminum and causes porosity. Is electrode extension as critical on aluminum as it is on steel? Why? No. Due to high electrical conductivity of the aluminum, due to higher travel speeds, what may need to be longer when welding aluminum? A larger gas nozzle. Aluminum oxide is a natural insulator. True. What are the most common gases you will use on aluminum with GMAW? Inert gases, argon and helium. What does aluminum need to be cleaned with? Stainless steel wire brush, power brush slash stainless steel wire wool. What is two advantages of using GMAW on aluminum? Higher deposition rates, no flux or slag, reduced cleanup, can weld in all positions, works on materials as thin as one-eighth inch thick, spot welding works well on light gauge aluminum. How soon after the cleaning process should you weld an aluminum joint? Why? As soon as possible. The aluminum oxide layer will rapidly return. Why must you apply light pressure only when cleaning aluminum? To avoid embedding abrasive particles in the metal surface, as this can result in weld contamination, why would you lightly preheat the aluminum before welding? To remove traces of moisture, what are the two most common filler metals for aluminum? 4043-5356 what is one of the four filler alloys not recommended for sustained high temperature service? 5356-5654 to 5183-5556. What are the three important dimensions on pipe? Outside diameter, OD, inside diameter, ID, schedule, wall thickness, at what size is a pipe identified by the outside diameter? 14 inch or larger, what is tubing measured by? The outer diameter, what does the wall thickness affect? The heavier the wall thickness, the smaller the ID. What is the included angle when fitting a pipe? 60 to 75 degrees. What should you ensure the land be on a pipe edge? Uniform and accurate. What shape jig do you use to tack up pipe? V-shaped. What can be a problem with an V-shaped jig when tacking up pipe? 
may not give good alignment of interior of the pipe, comma, what should you do if you find that the gap between two pipes is slightly unequal when tacking up? Rotate the pipe and tack the wider gap using the weld metal shrinkage to equalize the gap. What are wedges useful for controlling when tacking up pipe? Gap spacing, when feathering the tacks on pipe, what must you be careful about not doing? Not making the root face thinner or the gap wider, why must you feather permanent tacks? Ensure full fusion when welding the root bead. When welding a 2G weld, why do you always start with the bottom weld and layer upwards? It prevents weld metal from rolling down and causing overlap or lack of fusion. ASME certified companies must perform all welds how? Using specific weld procedures, what does a welding procedure specification sheet provide welders with? Directions for the welder to make repeatable quality welds of proven reliability while fulfilling all code requirements. What are variables on a welding procedure specification sheet? Base metals, filler metals, positions, Preheat, post-heat, joint configurations, techniques, any other details pertaining to the weld. What are ranges documented on a welding procedure specification sheet? Thickness, diameters, voltage, amperage, welding speed, materials, joint types, gas flow rates. What does is a WPS backed or supported by? Procedure Qualification Record, PQR, Name Processes of Heat Treating Aluminum. Annealing, Tempering, Solution Heat Treating, Homogenizing, Precipitation Hardening, Refrigerating, Stabilizing, Stress Relieving. What does a PQR state? Weld test specimen has been tested with WPS variables and consistently yields good welds. What are specific details on a WPS? Supporting PQRs, the latest revision, the base metal thickness or diameter ranges. The filler metal type and diameter, volts, amps, and travel speed, the shielding gas and gas flow rate, heat treatments, joint design, weld techniques, extra notes as required. What does SAW stand for? Submerged arc welding. Why is a screw type work lead connection recommended for saw? Provides a strong positive contact to the work and minimize heat buildup. Name components of a saw welding head assembly. Control unit, variable speed electric motor and gear box, wire straightener, drive roll assembly. Wire feed setups, torch assembly, flux feed and recovery system. How tight should you set your drive roll pressure? Wire feeds smoothly, yet will slip should a problem occur in the gun and cable assembly. What does amperage control in saw? Penetration burnoff rate. What is voltage? The force that overcomes resistance to allow amperage to flow, what does voltage have a major effect on? The weld bead fluidity and stick out, what does travel speed affect? 
Penetration and well-being profile. Decreasing travel speed increases what? Increases heat input. Possibility of burn through.